Anyway, uh, Odell has been bleeding throughout the night. That's because uh, the bot worm, you know, it needs to eat. So it chews away and it causes bleeding in the arm. Also, it defecates throughout the night. And it defecates throughout the night inside his arm. Okay, so this is uh, the bot worm lodged inside Odell's arm. That's what it looks like. And now we're going to take a closer look. Yeah. So, yep, that is the uh, bot worm. That's the cave. You can clearly see the hole there, and that's where it lives. Okay, so we've turned this uh, iPhone into a microscope. We've attached a mini microscope to it um, to observe the bot worm here. We'll see if this rig works, as you can see. We know. So we've adapted, uh, it's, it's a simple uh, microscope we've adapted to the iPhone. I have a microscope. For it to show up on the iPhone display. Yeah, yeah. So we'll see how it works. What we're trying to do is uh, look into an alien species living inside my brother's arm. That's really my mom. Mm. Uh, it should work on his arm also and yes, where, his, uh, where the hole where this thing is living. This is pretty gross. Or not. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, that's, that is pretty gross. It's oozing stuff. Okay, so you're gonna see something moving and it goes in and it goes out. In and out. And that's actually not its face, that's actually like its anus or something. Like, uh, it does that to keep the opening. So it can, what, breathe, right? Yeah, it needs oxygen. It needs oxygen, so it keeps going in and out, so it can breathe. And that's it. On the other side, uh, you have its head and uh, with, with um, a mouth, and it's chewing away. And I don't know why they put that in there, but... And those are actually a uh, bot worm egg eggs. And they lodge uh, beneath the wing of a fly, and the fly is called a vector. It's what carries it around and deposits it in different places. So these eggs hatch as soon as uh, they feel uh, mammal's temperature. A uh, mammal's temperature, okay, and they hatch. I think they're a little deflated right now. When you first brought them in, they're a little looking a little better, right? Yeah, they were alive. Yeah, they were alive. Okay, they did survive in the pods, though. Now they're dead. They were like uh, they actually look like a banana cluster. The same color, white. Yep. And oh yeah, so like, uh, uh, my brother's gonna keep this thing living in its arm for a while, so if you wanna see how it develops, we'll try to do some video blogging about it, so subscribe, I guess. <laughs> Peace.